This Sunday is the fourth Sunday in the season of Easter, and every year, uh, regardless of the lectionary cycle that we're on, the fourth Sunday of Easter is what we call Good Shepherd Sunday, and the gospel is always one of the passages where Christ likens himself to a good shepherd who tends his sheep, cares for his flock. And it's such a tender image, and especially in this Easter season, when we think about the resurrected Christ, thinking of him in that caring role is, is always a really tender moment. This year, we have the happy confluence of events that Good Shepherd Sunday is also Mother's Day. And it's a wonderful image to think of Christ as the Good Shepherd as we are honoring those in our lives who have been a mother to us, whether biological or, or through their care and through their shepherding of us. So we can both honor our tradition in observing Christ as the Good Shepherd, as well as using that as a lens for a way to think about our mothers and those who have been like a mother to us in our lives. So of course we have a really beautiful service planned for you here at St. John's. The opening prelude, the organ piece that starts the service, is a piece by the Winston-Salem based composer Margaret Sandresky. And it's titled with that passage from Proverbs, her children rise up and call her blessed. And it's this beautiful and very moving meditation on the care that a mother gives us. There are no words, it's, a, it's purely an organ piece, and yet you can feel the tenderness of that mothering as it comes through in the music. And then in the service that continues from that, all of the prayers and the readings and the hymns and the choral music all will pick up on those bucolic themes of shepherd or of sheep uh, being tended to. So we'll come in with that very familiar old uh, Episcopal hymn, uh, Monk's Gate, singing uh, Jesus our mighty Lord, with that second verse that starts, Good Shepherd of thy, of thy flock. So really pay attention especially to that second verse of the opening hymn. And then we will, uh, for the hymn of praise, we've been singing the Powell, Gloria, and Excelsis the last several weeks. We're going to change things up a little bit and do the John Rudder Benedictus S. Domine, which is very popular here at St. John's. Every, every week that we do that, it always gets a lot of smiles from the congregation. And then as we go forward, as I mentioned, the um, gospel will be one of these passages where Jesus talks about himself in terms of being a good shepherd. And leading up to that, of course, there's no Bible passage that speaks more of those images than Psalm 23. So the sequence hymn, we'll be singing the King of Love, My Shepherd Is, with that beautiful Irish tune, St. Columba. So we'll be singing Psalm 23 as the sequence hymn. And then chorally, uh, the choir has for the offertory a real rousing setting of Isaac Watts' version of Psalm 23, The Lord's My Shepherd, I'll Not Want. And at communion, a beautiful motet, really lush motet, um, Surexit Pastor Bonus, Arisen is the Good Shepherd. And it has these wonderful harmonies in it. And then there at the end, the organ postlude will also be a pastoral, something that kind of evokes the idea of being out on this hillside with a flock of sheep. So we have lots of really fun and imaginative and interesting music, great tunes with familiar uh, hymns that we will be singing, and wonderful prayers, and uh, another couple of special uh, things up our sleeve for the mothers in our congregation. So we hope that as you are honoring your mother or those who have been a, like a mother to you, that you will come and celebrate with us Christ as the Good Shepherd here at St. John's this Sunday.